some people are so scared mm. of checking the government. Mm. You've made it your business to speak out. Because these people support you. But how do you want Mtu anakuambia manzi mama yangu ako hivi, ako hosi. Manzi na hiyo ni kitu inafaa kuwa na shughuli na gava. Mwingine anakuambia manzi sina job, kwanza za job ni mingi. I cannot be able to help. Very uh, prominent person in the industry. Alisema mimi siyezifanya event hiyo ni nini kaya kwa kwa skits. Yeah, But you have creators who are coming up who do want to do something similar. Mm. There are a lot of people who don't want that to happen. So if you are able to break that ceiling, then that means everyone else will fly. Mm. Do people sometimes think your rate card is too expensive? Mm. Every time. Mm. I say, where? <laughs> Because my worth, how I quantify what I do is, first of all, it's research-based. In terms of tulianza, kifanya hata bure, kifanya mtu bure. But in terms of what the worth that i give you i'll give you quality mm -hmm. i'll go over and beyond and i'll give you those numbers you are looking for i'll give you yes. um the, the the leads you're looking for and it always works is it commensurate with what i'm getting as a person like what's your you time because a lot of times we don't have eight to five utajipata hata saturday sunday unafanya kazi but when do you say that sunday si fanya job so and i think that is a greater investment than anything else mm -hmm. because unless hapa uko sawa yeah everything else is zero Hey guys, welcome to today's episode of LNS. My name is Lynn Gugi and honestly, when I see my guest today, he reminds me of a book I read and I've said, guys, if you want great books, just go to Nuria. This is not an ad, but that book is called Why Small Businesses Fail and What to Do About It. It's the E-Myth, a very, very profound and thought-provoking book. And in that book, the author says, five years, startups don't even, like, Startups don't usually make it to the five-year mark. And when they make it to the five-year mark, there's another five years for them to be able to survive. So you can imagine, for you to know whether your business is going to survive or not, it, it takes you around 10 years. My guest today has done exactly that, 10 years in the industry. When I look at him, not only has he honestly set the path for so many people, but he's such an incredible person to speak to. Uh, with. I love that he uses his voice in matters policy and though we see him laugh a lot of times, I must say there is nothing about him that I've listened to that has not impacted my life. I'm about to let him introduce himself so that he can be able to walk us through his journey in 10 years in this industry. But before I do that, of course, you know, a girl has to say thank you to our amazing partners of today's conversation. So if you're watching this from Diaspora, why don't you try Tap Tap Send to send money to your loved ones are back home and always remember by using my code lean you are able to get a cash back on the numbers that are appearing on your screen and also to say thank you so much guys for getting us to 1 million plus mark I don't take that for granted you have been you guys have just decided that we are going to do this together that is something I do not take for granted and of course I have to say thank you to my team for always putting this together Over and over, I've said you get to see me in front of the camera, but it takes an entire team to be able to put this work together. And now, of course, without further ado, please allow me to let one of the people who gave me a chance when I was starting out in my career, one of the people I called and he said, Lin Tufanye Ikitu, introduce himself. <laughs> <laughs> Guys, is that me? Uja introduce him, but I'm going to Guys. Uh, my name is Timothy Kimani, <coughs> called Dark and Handsome, aka Nchugush, Kijana Mpole. And. <laughs> okay, you need introduction of Anya, Nimeambuan Kahibi. So, guys, I'm going to really try. I'm going to really try Kukahibi. But we will be here, man. Manze Lin. Unaza Vanya, Manze. Mogorino at Wegilemba. I wear the mic. Nice. Unapaka mutu mafuta. No, I wear the mic. The year is 2017, right? 2017. Yeah. I'm starting out yeah. at Tuko. Oh yeah. I don't know so many people in the industry. I hit you up. What did you say? Yende sana. Then we shot. Eh. Like a kuwa color what? Eh. Color purple. Eh. You remember? Yeah, And I remember. in my head, yeah. I was like, oh my goodness. I just interviewed Njugush. 
the interview turned out to be color purple mm. but one of the things you did you even shared it mm. on your platform and i was like even with this not being so perfect he still goes out and gives but me a shout out but you are perfect lean no i don't uh, think uh, so ah you are perfect <laughs> thing is eh? there's uh, every day when i come in the morning mu mbani patane tuna wasawafiti so might be anyone in the garage wherever wherever utapatana nao so this morning we wake up alafu tunapata eh, first of all tulikuwa <coughs> well ni vile sasa umetaja but sasa <laughs> so ilikuwa we were not so enthusiastic about eh, interviews uh, vlogs then because kuna watu walikuwa wamechoma picha yeah. so hatukuwa very enthusiastic then udema anapiga first of all anaongea vizuri aki sasa nilikuwa nauliza yani hata unashindwa kusema hapana yeah. then we came you are vibe na ukapiga interview fiti so minus the 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 the, the behind the scenes whatever whatever happened but the content ilikuwa fiti lin when ni mtu mpoa no which it's, it's, why are you holding yourself <laughs> I, i will i i don't have imposter syndrome mm. anymore so i'm going to take that mm. and i'm going to say thank you mm. but what would make you want to give someone a chance someone you know nothing about what would make you want to give mm. them a chance and is that a rule you operate by it's freely given freely lent oh. so whatever i have it's free there is nothing i did to deserve what i have in terms of platform in terms of whatever so whatever you can be able to do it's you you given freely so freely lent So I think it's it's that simple. It didn't minus anything. Haya. Hiyo siku kama ningekuringia lean. Leo ningekaa hapa. Kwanza. Eh, so gigo inaenda kwa garbage in garbage out. So eh so so and not only even for a favor maybe to be returned later but the the, the mere fact that it's freely given una freely give because it doesn't minus anything clean mm-hmm. mm. and now it's hiyo wakati huko nipea maji angalia leo ni kama kikombe hebu kunywa hebu tukunywe wewe lenes wewe Seven years mm. later mm. we get to see it together mm. and this is just a um, testament mm. of how, what discipline consistency and you following something over and over mm. can result to right mm-hmm. when I, there's a reason i brought 2017 mm. because i knew I, i by the way i i was so convinced if i follow this path mm. and i do it with so much conviction whether i'm sleeping hungry or not kitu itajipa no matter what happens kuna two rules in life ukizifuata something i'm not saying it has completely paid off but am i in a better place mm-hmm. absolutely yeah. when you look back to your journey mm. first congratulations on 10 years i used to <laughs> <laughs> okay i'm going to be mature thank you Lee. He, no, yeah. <laughs> con- no congratulations <laughs> on 10 years mm-hmm. not just 10 years mm-hmm. 10 years and still relevant because mm. it could be 10 mm-hmm. are you relevant mm-hmm. it could be 10 mm. does this still mm. does this still help you financially mm. maybe not mm. it could have been 10 years do people still love your art maybe not mm-hmm. right mm-hmm. so when you look back at those 10 years could you walk us through maybe how has that journey been and what principles have you lived by that have helped you get to where you are right now you are an author mm. even yeah. like best seller new I york times best <laughs> <laughs> so i think um, the last 10 years is first of all i came from a place of um, not known i came from a place of and i think also that's something maybe going back to the 2017 interview is is <clears throat> i'm always rooting for You see there are those guys when <coughs> you are starting kulikuwa na wao so walikuwa napiga interview there are those guys who are unless you're in this interview um you, you haven't really been into an interview so i'm always for guys who are not seen so to speak you know for the guys who are like um, you, you you are given the list of the list uh, where well, go and do the uh, whatever ask them the six questions you, you, you get the bare minimum uh, exactly the bare minimum no one really sort of they notice you and they see what you can be able to do but you sort of don't have a space so to speak so mimi am for those guys mm-hmm. yeah because that's where my story started so back in college i was in the kenyan mass communication i was doing journalism and and 
while there at the Kenyan Mass Communication, I I happen to be in a drama club. Remember back in high school in yeah. primary, I only did drama in primary school. Then in high school, we didn't have a drama club, so I came to college. And the first thing I did in, before even paying my school fees was going to ask what were drama on a partner because because by then I had KMC had the best drama. They had Akina OJs, the Akina Abel Motuas of this world, Morgan, whoever, whoever, Akina Fred in Dimuli, all those oh. guys were in uh, KMC and in that drama. So I was like, I want to go to this drama club. So that's the first thing I did. I asked where they meet. They told me the foyer. So long story short, we meet as first years and we need to showcase what we have. Mm-hmm. Remember in high school, I didn't do drama. Yeah. So here we are. And the alumni is on my OJ, Fred in the movie. I only see them on telly. So um, everyone is told to present what they have. So there were guys in that school that came to that school because of drama. So they were in high school, they did well in dances, in plays. And you know what? Um, they were picked just because of that. They were placed. Getting a placement in KMC is very tricky because they only take 20 students for each field. So oh. journalism 20 in the whole country. So it, it was quite... So there are guys who are picked just for that. They went and did film. So here I am. I didn't come from a school we used to do drama. So everyone has something to present. Is Pokua Mimi. So everyone presented, they have this piece they won with last year. Oh, even went to national with that piece. Oh, nice, nice. So we have someone who can do uh, solo verses. Hey, next. So I'm like, I don't have anything to present. So what I did, because um, me, I'm seeing the guys here. Mm. And I love drama. Only that I don't get opportunity because these guys for drama are the ones who are given first priority. So guys who are in Kakamega. Kakamega, these are guys who used to write their own scripts and direct. Me, I've never seen that. We used to have teachers hired, I mean, uh, the directors hired mm-hmm. to come and direct our play. Yeah. So I come to this place where students are writing a script to go. They even went all the way to national. So um, we, we, we had that whatever. So me, I didn't have anything to present. So I just nearly pig and duro. I let out a big scream. And then it was so awkward. Everyone is like, what happened? Then I pick a king in it. And then everyone laughed. So I think, I don't remember if it's Abel or who asked, who is that? I'm like, it's me. So they call me in front. So which school do you come from? First of all, that school, no one have ever heard of it. Because, you know, in that, whatever, people have heard of Mukumu, Chava, Tulukotumatanana, Kachme, Gazi, Yuinini. So Mimi ni metoka Naro High School. Where? Naro. Naro. It's in Kandara Kifereke, mm. Kapuruge. Mm. Just after Kapuruge, before mm. Kandara, mm-hmm. on the other side. Twitter six acre. Yes. So uh, actually it was 74 the mm. the PO box. And uh so I've come from a school where no one knows the school. Ah when you know Manze Chava, they have those two stories, eh? Yeah. It's like the guys for Mercedes. Oh na kagan. Na uko hapo na Toyota. So yeah, so uh, so uh, that's for Abel. Wow. <coughs> <laughs> so now I I I, I um I in the shell. <laughs> <laughs> so I, I I I I got to be called in front and they told me present what you have. I didn't have anything to present. I let out another beautiful scream. <laughs> and then guys were like, this guy is stupid. And then the alumni went like, I like this guy for nothing, for because everyone else anyway had a verse. It's so boring. I come and see a verse. Oh, parents. Oh, another one comes. Oh, Kenya. Yo, have something unique. <laughs> so that's what Nduru. caught eyes of those guys. I piggered the Nduru and then the guys were like, oh, that's quite something. But that's it. So we went again and did um, now the drama. In Africa. Drama season. So we are rehearsing. I cannot get any, any placement because we have number one guys who are in Kakamega. Or Chavakali, those are the number one priority. Mm. Because these guys were my finesse. In Ikitushule, in high school, they were being given time to go out of whatever they are doing. Morning preps, and a curry house. Evening, Baka, there's some special food for them. You know, those uh, there are some schools that took really extracurricular activities very serious. serious. Uh, like, for example, Kakamega, they have that different diet for la- rugby guys and, and football guys and, and drama in terms of time. Oh, wow. So quite narrow, there's nothing. Uh, there is nothing. Uji power. Hata uji ya guna ni. Tuliko na ita muhua. Muhua was cocoa. And uh, some hot cocoa. Without milk. 
So uh, Time Your Drama Festival came by then nationals were at Bomas of Kenya. So there's something the alumni used to come. Now after coming to inaugurate the first years, mm. they used to come back and see how far are you with the rehearsals so that we know if you are ready. Yes. So again this time now, even a bigger group came. Akina Oje, Indimuli and other people that are only so on daily. Manzi you're like, guy, uni nani, uni nani. I'm like, what? And remember I don't have a a, 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 a character. So, th- how this happened is, mm. uh, um, as I said, they were the priority guys. So, I was patiwa. Then, the shadow cast, in a patiwa mtu mwingine, they are still good. Nimu deadly. But they are second. Mimi kumbuka si jabai pika iyo nyesho kwa iyo level. Mm. So, I have to wait. So, all the places were taken. The main characters, they were taken. Many I'm going to go for the list. Because that's where I belong. Mm. I belong to the list. So, I went and took... a. Uh, a guy who had three lines, he was called Habakkuk. No one wanted the lines because the lines were, yes, my lord, yes, my lord. Yes, my lord, that's one. Yes, my lord, that's two. Yes, my lord, three, and you're done. So, now I'll go and gear, uh, um, scene eight. So you have to wait for the stars. Wapige onyesho. Wapige, and then now you come, yes, my lord, do not So something happened. Uh, when the alumni came, they came with a guy called Jeff Ioma. Yeah. So Jeff came and he spent time with us. He used to love dancing. Tukafika play. Aka watch your play. Aka niuliza bro. Unajua hizi line hata nikita ule mama. Akuji ya pige hizi line zata piga. So how different are you going? Sorry. Mm. So how different are you going to be? For, 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 for. So I sat down and mm-hmm. thought. Eh? It's about lunch time when we're going to have the last rehearsal so that we meet in the evening to have the final dress rehearsal with the alumni and everyone who was invited. And even Akina Cleo Malala, hey. Cleo Malala by then alikuwa Riara and some other big schools wame come because now we used to do it as a team. So they come, wana adjudicate their like tangeneza ni hapa. So that's the evening, yeah. today evening. So during lunch time, I didn't go to lunch. Uh, Jeff Ayama told me, Ninja Kanyambia, sit down and think of that. And this might change everything. So I sat down and thought, what do I do with the yes, my lord? Because yes, my lord is yes, my lord. I remembered back in uh, um, in uh, Maunarok. Maunarok, my dad was posted there. So Maunarok, we had a Kamze who was the watchman. So he used to come and uh, fika six and azunguka. Then maade to nampelekea food. Then atonga to mfungia inje. So we used to lock from outside. <laughs> <laughs> from outside. So I'm like, hey, me but that's <laughs> not <laughs> so I'm like, hey, but it was old. Yes. So I'm like, Jumzaya na jitafutia food. Sawa, tu nahana watu wake. Mm. So that guy, he didn't have teeth. So he used to pick. <laughs> Even the mokimo, he used to, to eat without maize. Mm. <laughs> <laughs> so that's what I thought that could work. So I'm like, yes, my lord. <laughs> Let me tell you, we came to lunch. I was waiting for my eighth scene. Nikapiga. Yes, my lord. Yani, what was Actually, we stopped. <laughs> and Jeff was like, that's it. Long story short, we met in the evening. So everyone is waiting for that kapat for the eighth scene. Kaitwa. Yes, my lord. The whole for year went down. Like guys were like, who is that guy? He's that guy for Nduru. Eh? Ay, ja, 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 ja. Do you know what happened that day? Fred Indimuli, Abel, OJ, they insisted this guy needs to be more in the story. So what you need to do is you need to start with him. He needs to be more in the story. So play Libadilishwa. So we went, of course, Vile Likua. To tukaenda, accommodate you. Mm, tukaenda, um, by then, I think, to Likua um, NYS. So NYS, Tukaipiga. Is it NYS? Am I Utali? So either of the mm-hmm. two. Tukaipiga. And then, before we went to Gala, because that's what we call Gala. There's the first performance. Then the best of the best, they, they proceed to Gala. Yeah. Where, again, we may to work. Maybe the Minister of Education then yes. and whatnot. So, Tukapatana. So, Gala... Okay. Akina Fred in, in, insisted that Habakkuk, I was called Habakkuk, needs more time on stage. Do you know what happened? Mm-mm. The whole story changed now. I used to start. 
So the story was about a king who had no male um, inheritor. Mm. Hey, I want to talk about hair. Yes. Hair. Hair. Yeah. So he didn't have that. But the way we uh, they twisted, because I was not in the sitting panel, the way they twisted the story is that I had, long time ago, I had the king rape a worker and they had a baby boy. So there's a baby boy in that um, kingdom that is the king's son. Wow. So when it is started, that's how it was starting. Yes. And then the king, um, uh, we, we, we take an oath mm-hmm. never to say that. And then that was it. So everyone knows, I know. So every time I used to come on stage, I have something to say. They're like, no, 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 no. So it was so, it, it changed the whole story and I was more involved and I was actually given the adjudicator story. Now, long story wow. short, this is where I was coming. Yes. Story. That's how me and Abel met. So Abel saw this guy now in Bomas of Kenya, to Mendagala and, and everything. And he was like, that guy is stupid. He's the guy from Nduru now, he's this guy. By then he had started a show called Hapakule News yeah. and it was doing badly. Yeah, yeah, yeah. <laughs> so I helped him. <laughs> so Abel gave me a call. Me, I never knew Abel. So yeah. namuona but simrank. Freddy sim simrank. So guys are like, una pigiwa na Freddy tidy eye. I'm like, oni nani? Abel mutua. Eh, yeah, okay. Kapik, he's like, eh, hey, niaje? Eh, we have uh, nini for you. Inaito hapa kule news. I was doing journalism. So I'm like, nenda kufanya news. I'm like, okay. Easy. Yeah. And long story short, I went the first um, episode to Lifanya Sijai how It was for a cute guy. I, I, I think I was Saudi Arabia or something. Yes. And he was very cute. Now he was being deported. He was confused with mama. So, ya Kenya kuna msi aliko menda kongu. That was me. I did it in, the, in, a, in a bathtub. That was the first show. It was such a hit. Um, I remember it was the third episode of Hapakule News. It was such a hit. I was just kupitia to come extra. You already alikuwa na tight crew. And you already amesema, on your crew, mm. on your cast rather. So I, um, nikapiga the first show. Hey, akanimbia tena uko available next week. Because bado I'm in school, KMC. I'm like, yeah, I'm available. Come pig, upige extra ingine. Nilipiga my extra mpaka wasa wakajua nka kale kamse. So YouTube wana itaka kale kamse. Ah, ndiyo uyu. So one day we decided to tafte jina. So to make even Abel. Abel and tafte jina. Kali yenye. Kila mtu atajua hii brand. Juwa seo meanza kutambo pale kwa mtandao. So we really look for a name. Until the director, Ntua Idhaka Mukuri, he's like, no guys, we are wasting time. Let's go. Tuta tafte jina wakati mungina. Tuliko pale church road. Samo ya longwa ya kiwe. And then uko nyuma, there were some cab guys. Walikuwa na itana. Wee, jukuna! We are like, tuende na hiyo. That's how Jugush came to be. Damn. So we can do Juguna. Then come Tanda, what to come attacking Juguna? Yes. Jugush. Sasa waka ileta tu, Jugush. Yeah. Yeah, yeah. So, his story to go under 10 years. Nisawa. Sasa tumekuja. Mm. Um, long story short, to kapiga after hapo, hapa kule news, to kapiga shuika kwa fiti. We did a ka story, a ka episode, kaliko na real house heads of Kino. It was a hit, Sasa. Wachana na ile hapa kule news. Ilikuwa na hit. You know that video yako na juonga ili, ili, ili break? Ili enda. So that was it. And then guys were like, when is the next episode? So Abel had this idea kutoka wakio tahidi of ku, ku, kufanya shoes yes. that are Kenyan za mamboch. Jusisi tunafanya gaza ofisi, law firm, nini, nini, kampuni. Siju baba hako alikuwa na kampuni. Mm-hmm. But stories zile zinakuwa ganyumbani tukisha toka. Our stories. Eh, hey, sasa hao warembo wakisha haka, wanajua baba nani, anakuja gaza aflani, and what not. Mm-hmm. So they had this map. So Abel akandika hiyo. So badai tunasikia KTN wanataka hiyo shoe. We did a pilot, ikapelekwa, ata kabla warudi, imesha wekelewa, coming soon. Na hiyo watermark. Hey. So again, we did another 100 episodes with Abel. Wow. The show was a hit. Yani, mbaka diaspora, mbaka wapi. Yani, watu wali kwa nakuja. That was crazy. Eh, hey, watu wali kwa nakamu. Wana sema tunata kwa na njugush. Njugush ni kukamulu, sina fea. Na umetoka mayolo. Na unataka kuni na uo. You want to know me? me. <laughs> <laughs> Yo, so pale, ikafika mahali towards the end of the 100th episode, asema yo, tumepiga job, it's only fair to uneka tutaumezo kama mshahara. Sawa ye, manzi tukaitana na kuru yote. Kuangu na kumbukaga tukipata na kino. Tukakachi, tukasema manzi mpaka tuongeze mshahara, jusho pia meanza kuleta. Eh, at least tukafiti. <laughs> 
mm. gapatana 20 mm. that was in 2015 mm. going to 2016 because masa sa contract ya 2016 tuongezeka kitu na kana 2022 atutamaini but tuongezewe because it's been a 100 episodes yes we january ikafika mimi nangoja kuitwa si tumekatana mimi ni kama ndio nilikuwa kiongozi wa juu hata wameniambia wewe enda kusema you are the star Eh mimi pale January kisha naona set life. Naona kama vile mko hapa mtu anapiga set life. Eh. Eh, shoot things. Hashtag #shoot things. <laughs> ah, Nashinda watu wamerudi ku shoot bila. Na <laughs> jamii. Mimi ndio star sasa show. Eh. Hey. Eh hey, kesho tena shoot na wako na costume mpya si zile so hii ni wana shoot saa hii. Ah. Nikauliza mmoja, "Eh hey, kwani kuliendaje?" Kaniambia kwenda huko hata usiniongeleshe. Ha. Wao walikuwa natuchocha tuongezewe mshahara kumbe wao walishaongezewa. Wow. Eh yeah, so I think walienda waka chocha chocha waka usipo uta. Mm. So long story short, hivyo ndio niliondokea. So usikuaitwa. Mm. So nikasema ni sawa. Eh nikapigia beli. Eh Adeli. Sasa <laughs> ni kama nimetolewa job. Mm. Akanambia ah walai hata sisi hatuko. Ah nikamwambia kabisa, ushajipata kwa makosa lakini mko na best yako yes. ama mko na chupi. Hiyo chocha hubamba. Exactly. <laughs> Number one. <laughs> Kama namba 1 amepigishwa magoti tuko sawa. Prefect mwenye ndio huyu ah kabisa kaenda sana. So I knew with Abel niko sawa because again Abel had the had the character bible ya ya Real Houses of Kangore. Those wengine hata ni watu wanajua. So he had the character bible so I was like if Abel is off then I'm off. Eh kama mbaya mbaya hatuna plan eh, but Abel hauna form. Kamisa. Abel akamwambia akanimeka mimi sina. Tulika juu ya mawe I remember E, kuna msupa anaitwa Sele. Sele ndiye alikuwa na kamtrua. Nauza masuruali, anatumia kakiru. <laughs> kuna wakati nimeitwa interview, kaitia na bana siku ana kakiru. So naenda sina fare ya kurudi. Nimeenda na matatu nikashuka, kaingia, nikapigwa interview, alafu sasa naangoja Sele anatumia 50 bob. Juu nilikuwa na shit transami, so 50 bob atani mingi. Eh, <laughs> ngoje. Mwenye alikuwa na interview anatoka ananiambia Ah, uh, can I drop you? Nambi, ah, I'm waiting for my car. Yeah. 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 You're waiting for what? For my car. Sasa, you to require be buy. Unajua? Uko na jina but hauna ka kitu. That thing can get in your head. Famous and broke. Eh, hey, juu kuna wakati hata mtu ameniona nikinunua mafuta taka. Ni zaia, jugo cha tawa natumia nga mafuta taka. Eh, nikamwambia natumia nga kufua so nini troza. <laughs> pale transami. <laughs> Juu sasa ananiuliza wewe kwenda huko. So anyway. <laughs> so eh naongojea kutumwa 50. Do you know how hard it is to ku- withdraw 50 bob? Kwanza umeenda na kajampa kuna kajampa nilikuwa na vao mainama hivi. Naambia huyu mkuu mpesa niaje. Nataka kutoa 50 bob. Niki a uh-uh, a nikiwa na 70 bob naweza toa how much? Yes. Juu hii ndio iko. Yeah. So nataka kutoa the closest to the feet. decimal point. Yeah. Eh ananiambia ah yule anaweza toa 50. Ah. Juku wewe kwani unakaa juu? Hebu toa. Ah jogos. <laughs> wewe sisiri hebu kuja uone jogos. Jogos unataka kutoa 50. Sisiri akaa maki jogos. Ai. <coughs> wa. Wa. Ai 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 yo imagine yo ni nakupil so eh hey. tuka manuva manuva then word went i think but to but 50 ulitoa eh nilitoa na nikaenda nyumbani okay <laughs> bila sasa unatoa na maeni pe 50 eh gani ni nini sasa kameshachomeka so then after there i think um, things worked out um, we we got another gig or other kinabel <coughs> sasa waka form company yao mm. this is another story why he left yes. waka form company yao yeah. and sasa hapo at least nikaushio kwa uandishi tukajika kaka kidogo then later on sasa ndio nimeingia digital mm. so that is 2016 yeah. actually year 2016 ndio nimeingia digital towards the 2016 end na mwanzo wa 2017, 2017. so it's uh, so after hapo sasa eh sasa si ndio tukapatana tukapatana yeah. eh. sasa sasa hiyo jina iko juu yeah. niko sawa by them mtandao iko sawa because then um, tulikuwa tumeanza at least because now with digital came money because hii nyingine tulikuwa tv 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 no money but now with digital kuna do Eh hey, uko sawa kuna do. So we 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 did digital and and by then it was transact because that, that's the only thing mm. we had. Mm. Tumeona na msupa ni 2016 na tuna kitu ya kudu. Kuna vitu nimekuwa ni scribble nikiandika I have a lot of materials that I do want us to shoot. She's like she can simulate a simu record to make it there and that's how we did until one day someone came and offered us 5000. Mm. 
to kuweka product hapo kwa video zetu we like kwa nini unatulipa tukamwambia tunaweza fanya kama hizi 50 10 eh, wewe kwa nini unatulipa 5 eh, na tunaweza lipa 50k eh 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 hello haku wai tulipa ndio tulipa 25k but that's when i knew yeah digital economy this guy was willing na hakuna hata kitu ya maana tumefanya mm. nikuchukua ka kitu kake tukasema sijui nini and then we continued if this guy is willing to pay 5000 when we have like um, we had like 50000 people on instagram what else is there what if we hit a mic atalipa tu 5 ah, itakuwa different so that's how we started by then instagram ilikuwa inachukua video was for 15 seconds so ilikuwa na video fast yes. <laughs> and then you post it mm-hmm. so it's been a journey okay. and um then we came from there then we garnered a lot of numbers and people were like um si mo organize kitu tunaweza meet like oh. cuz now online ni, ka, ni poa we but only meet here every eh hey, but tunataka naweza appreciate ju tunakupenda naweza appreciate manzi organize kitu hata kama walikuwa naita meet walikuwa naita meet and greet mm. eh hey, tupate fanya meet and greet and i was like you know what the first meet and greet that we did ilikuwa um, yeah for some fans when you welcome machine there is a product that gonna push and mm. took a select like 10 and it was amazing because you get to hear first hand of what and you get to see these people because online on a gawa say john gatwili you know someone by the um the username handle, exactly username but how do you want to unaweza muweka wapi mm-hmm. even when unaongea mm-hmm. na clients unaambia gani kuna watu wie jitu wie but how are you how are you until now you meet you meet them physically so that's when we decided now to do our first a uh, uh, stand up show that was in uh, garden city sold out for the first million kwa government kwa nataka kitu ya 300 then ikaenda ikakuwa hapana we started selling tickets tulikuwa ya watu 2000 ilikuwa ikuwa watu 1000 we started selling ali bad tickets tukafunga within one week and then we were like ai sasa tena 1000 imeja yeah So tulienda tukiongeza mpaka the first show I think ilikuwa 2500. Wow. That's the first physical show we had and that opened our eyes because we never knew and even for clients you lenda kwa client unamwambia nataka kufanya show. Ati unataka tweet up. Nani hebu kuja John Tebu skiza huyu hebu mwambie. Okay so mimi nataka kufanya show ni ita. But unajua wewe tumekuzoea na clips. Yes. Hawoni nikamwambia sasa hizo clips ndio na data stage. Hizo ndio watu wanataka si Good. mimi. Ni watu. Mm, si mimi. Na siwaambii mkuja. Kile una hauelewi ni ati sikwaambii ukuje show wewe. <laughs> mimi ni pesa yako nataka. Mm-hmm. Juu nitaleta watu. Yes. So long story short we did the show. And ndio watu walikuwa nakuja. Hey hamu kutuambii ingekuwa hivi. Sasa ulikuwa unataka tukwambiaje? Nilikuja nikakwambia niko na hawa watu already. Nimeuza hizi tickets. Oh, hey hi. Na like, hiyo crowd yako ilikuwa kumbe whatever I was doing is whatever It's they were doing what they because now when you look at your crowd you able to tell huu ni mtu maybe yako uni huu ni buda ameka mna dota yake huyu you are able kuna mtu hata alikuwa ameka mna shusho yake you are able to tell vile inakata kuna mtu ame align holiday yake na hiyo date ametoka sijui Germany you like kwa Germany unaona utoto yangu you get so now after there we are like there's no stopping but covid ni nani mm-hmm. ikatuambia that is stopping so that's when we mm. did uh, ttnt 2 through the 2 ilikuwa na watu 16 these 16 guys ni wase tulitumia email when we started you kulikuwa na covid kuambia niaje tuko na show we didn't want it to be huge so tulikuwa nataka watu 200 because of the third so tulikuwa watu 200 yes. twende pale Kenya National Theater we hiyo date me announce hivi uhuru anasimama alikuwa ananiboa akifanya hizo interview anaita media yani amjui nini itafanyika <laughs> Leo amefunga kanisa, kesho amefunga shule. Sasa akafunga mpaka county. Hiyo those were dark times. Amefunga county, yani baba yangu alifungiwa mpaka na ni mchungaji alilaruliwa karatasi. <laughs> Unakumbuka this there are some two papers eh he used to Peter Naz. So yeye alikuwa na Peter anaenda kuhudumia wao. Ila rudi na polisi akamwambia sasa mali tumefika kila mtu akae kwao. So uhuru amekuja akasema now by the four going I nikasikia hata ile dhad unajua alikuwa amepatia na rusia dhad na room hiyo pia imetolewa there is no in person meeting yo na tushatuma email watu 20 walikuwa wamelipa so what do you do tena u refund so we refunded then kidogo kidogo amefungulia yeah. now you can meet a dhad so the guys who had paid to come yanyaje issue tukiendelea kukana tujui vile kutaendelea hatutaifanya come in to record watu 16 kwa pale media, uh, baraza lab 
kujeni watu eh, ah, watu 20 audio to record now your show those are guys who had paid to karudishi ado but you like jumla kama lipa kama ni for free tukapiga show tukapiga show then sasa ndio tukaanza monetization tukaikilia kwa website tulikuwa na madeni ya show ya kuanza hiyo show ya pili ndio ililipa Yeah, 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 so from there 20 uh, TNT3 tukarudisha Kenya Cinema. We went to TNT4, tukaipeleka KICC. Zote zimekuwa sold out hata hiyo ya watu 20. Yeah. Uh-huh. <laughs> Then uh, now recently sasa tukafanya hii ya uh, juice ya July 27. Yes, that was crazy. So yeah, 10 years. Mm. Just like that. Mm-hmm. And I'm still to all dark and hands. <laughs> Na una za piga nduru bado. Hiyo sasa ni. Yeah, ikibidi. Eh, ikibidi na piga. Yeah, but pull up. Mm. Let me take you back. You mm. said a lo- I was just mad. I did. No, 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 mm. you're good. Ni wewe meniambia ni sema. No, uko sa. No, it's good. I just mm. did not want to interfere mm. with your thought mm. pattern, but you said a lot of things and something really got to me. You were given three lines. Mm you were given the list basic shika easy mm. lines tattoo then you went ahead and said i have these three lines but i know somebody who does something that i can use to multiply mm. these three lines mm. into something mm. ukachukua ukakuwa influenced na mzee mm. na ukasema i won't just show up mm. and say yes my lord mm. i will put the act the character mm. it mm. has to come out right mm. Mm. and sometimes what i struggle with with us as human mm. beings it's how basic we want to be it's mm. our inability to take that which we know we have mm. and decide i know this is what i have mm. but i need to work mm. on what i have mm. to make it bigger mm. the our unwillingness to put in the work to move from this step to mm. that step mm-hmm. right how has that helped you in your life where you know in the basic mm. you even talking about 16 people mm. attending a show mm. but you just came from filming over mm. 2000 mm. people mm. how are you able to now say i know i did that but i can still come down and mm. do how are you able to navigate that? first of all i think um I I I I I mean Mungu wangu ni mkubwa that's that's the first thing me yeah. I know God wangu hakuna kitu hawezi so from that is I have this this what you given and everyone else wako hata na better kuliko hiyo mm-hmm. cuz you'll find you even have more talented people but for some weird reason our end mali kuna kitu hawafanyi why that extra mimi mu mu sema you need to do something extra because yeah, what you have someone else are going extra so for you for you to match up this you must go extra and that is all the difference that's why you see some averagely talented people are doing so well than overly talented people why is because you realize where you are you realize mm. what you're working with now you have to use this so i i, I think um, The, the idea of you basic utabaki to basic alafu mko wengi and that's why i think for me i'm always i'm always standing out hata tukipiga picha i just want to stand out mm-hmm. i just want to be different eh you can't talk as this what tunafanana just be let people talk about you so i think that age na saa nyingine is misconstrued kama kimbele mbele which is good eh you unapata gumu toko na kimbele mbele at member class you do this work and then yenyu mpaka mmekadha sasa hizo groups zingine zimeleta yenyu mmeka mpaka cover ile ya blue at now we have presented <laughs> nikierere but for some weird reason it comes from a very good place but for some weird reason it makes the whole difference it will make the whole difference mm-hmm. um, there is a time we went to i went to bbc i never thought in my weirdest dreams hata kama nimetoka kmc i could go to bbc So this how it happened. I met uh, JB Masanduku. JB Masanduku had gotten a job there at BBC. And BBC B- is big. It's huge. So tulikuwa tuna act and he thought this guy is funny. So JB told me kuna job nimepata nini si ukuje kuwe mgeni wangu. Then I think he got another job so akasari. So when I was going that that the JB told me to go, he was not there. Alikuwa amenda job nyingine. So mimi kwenda E, na ona hakuna nilikuwa nikwe mgeni but kuna mgeni mwingine i think shikskapenga ndiye alikuwa alikuwa mm-hmm. na rafton mm-hmm. 
ai nikashindua yai kwa sasa kwani tuko watatu na niliambia mgeni ni mmoja so it happened kila mtu aliita mgeni so hawakuwa na job ina kama cause by then JB ame, ame move on to the other job mm-hmm. so mimi niko hapo eh, madam aliko hapo ya ni juu ya ni tambui ni mbriton kwanza hiyo anjaga wesha nikamwambia um watch what you are doing you're gonna be doing next week i'm like ah simi ni mgeni kama leo vile nimekuja hapa yes. kama mgeni nika yeah. watch the next week kuja wako na mgeni mwingine because it's, it's it was a youth and leadership show so they needed someone um, someone fancy either musician artist mm-hmm. mwenye ata connect my youth to break down the jargon ya whatever so mimi nimeka the next show naona tena kuna mwingine kuna mgeni na host ai na, na kuna mse mwingine pale ameshikilia mzai fulani tu ameshikilia yeye ndiye anaida ifuse mm. sema nini nini ai nikauliza ndai kwa mgeni lini juu kama hii ni wiki apidi nakumbuka sina fare hii ni ile wakati nimetoka job natatiwa pesa ya masuruali so sina fare na natoka waiyaki na natoka huko magana sina fare na selia ameniambia ai hii kitu anakuita ita hivyo manze wakikuita wiki nyingine usiende kambi acha tu niende hii ya the second one manze after the show madam akanimpea ni baki I can realize how busy are you? I'm like I'm very busy. Ay 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 can be okay we just need your Mondays and Thursdays. Ah. Nikamwambia unajua zina kazi? Nikamwambia okay. Eh what do you want? Akaniambia I've been telling you to watch what they're doing because kuna ile kiti nataka ukalie. So I want you to be the resident um, comic whatever. Wow. Ay nikamwambia ay wa serious. Eh, kumbe, ni sawa, nikamwambia ni sawa, but in my head I'm not qualified. I am basic. But kumbe kuna kitu extra niko nayo. So, of course akaniambia kuna watu wengine pia tunajaribu, but if you are available, I hear you are good. Nikakumbuka nilikuwa Kenya Institute of Mass Communication. Niko na diploma yangu iko mahali. I'm good. So the next week, excuse me madam, can I see you? No way you have done general Kenya so much yo hapo ndio kutafutwa kwa wao watu wengine ilisha that's how i got the job one year contract mm. na kama si hiyo jobs juu ningekuwa wapi so i think your story a basic we can all be basic na tutulie but there's that something extra whether ni masomo whether ni kikierere there's that strength you have ukimiminia kwa hii basic ay, 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 ay. it makes all the difference because a lot of times tunaangalia ngo kwa nini nichukue huyu mko wengi mnafanana but there is that one thing that will set you apart it's a, it's non negotiable hiyo mm. ikitolewa ni niliekelea hiyo karatasi hivyo because what you are doing is journalism niliekelea hiyo karatasi hivyo the whole thing was stopped because mm. sidhani kuna mtu atamachi by then and even now Kenya in mass communication in terms of journalism in terms of field production in terms of tv production it's go to all the media houses in Kenya and so on na siringi mm. unajua kuna wanaanga watu wanafanya advert oh we have flani flani sisi tukifanya advert itakuwa series Ata- <laughs> season 1 <laughs> Kenya is a mass communication <laughs> anyway on a light note yes. but, but um, yeah so for me basic basic ni poa mm-hmm. and at times it's very comfortable because basic is what you know is what you are is what you're comfortable in but doing that extra and that's why a lot of people don't do the extra mm. because it's a lot of work it mm-hmm. takes that extra energy at times unasikia aibu ushaienda kufanya kitu unasikia hebu like for example ndio nilikuwa nasema when we are shooting I always go extra because when you are shooting tuseme umeenda kwa in a village somewhere you are shooting unaogopa watu sasa watakuwa naje mm-hmm. umejipaka paka mm-hmm. sijui unafanya aje unapiga nduru sijui aje but for me that's my extra and that kuweka that extra whatever and, and also i think investing in what you're doing kuna kitu mzee fulani aliniambia belmutua aliniambia The, the, we were shooting and he had a box guitar so after we malizard shooting nikachukua hiyo box guitar haraka haraka watu walianza kucheza cheza nayo nikachukua hiyo box guitar nikairudisha kwa nyumba yake isiharibiwe kanimbia sasa hapa umekosea sababu hii kitu tuna shoot inaweza nunua gita kama hizi nne hii shoot tumepiga leo inaweza nunua gita kama hizi nne so hata hii kiharibika ikiwa kwa kazi iko sawa mm. juu tunapiga job so i think the investment in what you're doing also could be something extra mm-hmm. mm, could ha- be mm-hmm. uh, sorry it's okay mm. ha- ha- sorry how have you invested you, are, you yourself mm. as mm. a creative mm. how mm. have you invested in your art 
other than uh, the, the the obvious in terms of um, the hardware in terms of of the technical equipment and mm. what not mm-hmm. i think um research is one of the biggest investment in terms of what content you want to do what kind of a brand you want to be who do you associate with who do you want to be known as because a lot of times we don't know what we want mm. so that includes talking to pr people talking to uh, brands what like for example every time a brand calls me i ask why did you choose me why why did you choose me then they are like we are looking for a b c d so i'm like ah then you go to the next one why did you choose me we were looking for so no nakuna vitu zinawana so whatever that is you invest company research or or money because a lot of times we companies have budgets for advertising yes but mimi as a brand how am i advertising myself so and it should be very intentional mm-hmm. so that is something being intentional about how you want to be seen cuz kila siku una pia unafanyaga sawa that we know but are you being intentional in what you're doing there are some clips i do not because i want to them to be funny there's something i'm saying and i'm talking to someone who is because i realize people watch and they're like this is a good fit mm. Mm. like for example just an example when you talk about ukona jeshi ya diaspora you without knowing or you knowing you're talking to someone who has a solution of how money can be sent from wherever they are to Kenya and vice versa. Mm-hmm. If you didn't talk about your diaspora people, I know we watch, but I didn't know is that huge. Mm. I didn't know there are people wana nihusu in whatever you're doing. So in terms of um, in, in terms of money and also in terms of longevity, net or longevity. Longevity. Exactly. Yes. Uh, because you want to be around for a while. So what do you do to make that happen? what do you do and also investing in other people in terms mm. of um, creative voice mm-hmm. in terms of fanya hivi cheza hivi hiyo ukifanya hivi inaweza kuwa better because also that will ensure you also have longevity even when you're longer there bado kuna manzi kama sio mtu fulani so i think for me as a, as, a, as a creative that's how i do the other investment is my me time because more often than not we don't take care of ourselves uh, so uko tu unaulizwa insurance una Unaulizo pale mwisho umepanga aje like niko na bima ya kifo huko na... <laughs> <laughs> it's in, it's taking care of ourselves and those that we love eh? yes because sasa mimi najua in case ni, niende watu wangu wako fit kuna mm. mali watata waka kitu so and also maybe taking care of myself as a person like what's your you time because a lot of time we don't have 8 to 5 utajipata hata saturday sunday unafanya kazi but when do you say that sunday sifanyagi job it's my family time mm-hmm. like when do you say this week i'm breaking for my solo there is no reason for a break it's just you going for that solo break eh unaenda kwa nyumba kuna mali nilienda nikajifungia 7 days because that's how i i, I decompress na kaa tu unaamka una kula unalala unaamka unaangalia nje na kula unalala so and i think that is a greater investment than anything else mm-hmm. because unless hapa uko sawa yeah everything else is zero crumbles yeah, exactly and everything i feel like else. a lot of creatives struggle mm, you burn you, you burn juo unaenda because there's no set when you other people you send an email they tell you oh 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 out of office yes you're like ah must be nice wewe unakimbizana huyu amekuja huyu amekuja nafaa kushoot hii kuna hii content mpya tunafaa kushoot mm. tunafaa kuketi kufikiria but you need to there's a reason why what we're going to live now for days uh, so i think that is a greater more than anything else invest in mm. yourself uh, because apa kama uko sawa then everything else ni nyewe mm-hmm. is crazy ideas mm. is beautiful ideas of taking care of other people now will come okay mm. ha, you are worth eh? mm. cuz le- i love that we said i love and i love telling people digital platforms mm. have money mm. i'm not going to gatekeep and tell mm. people oh, there is no money mm. don't try that mm. digital platforms have money you can get money through adsense you mm. can get money through advertisers mm. you can get money through what you've just said advertisers brand mm. promotions mm. visibility mm. how do you get to say this is my worth mm. and have you ever experienced a brand that you really wanted to work with but they could not match your value mm. and do people sometimes think your rate card is too expensive mm. every time mm. when <laughs> 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 then they didn't hang up <laughs> so i had on the other side of the say hey 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 where hivyo so i cut and then i called back nalipisha hivyo kwa sababu 
Sometimes be petty. I encourage people to be petty. <laughs> so nikamwambia nalipisha hivyo kwa sababu of ABC because my work how I quantify what I do is first of all it's research based in terms of tulianza kifanya hata bure fanyia mtu bure but in terms of what the worth that I give you is it commensurate with what I'm getting yeah in terms of mimi najua nikichapa hivi I'll give you quality mm-hmm. I'll go over and beyond and I'll give you those numbers you are looking for I'll give you yes. um the, the the leads you're looking for and it always works research based over time for 10 years tumekuwa tukifanya hiki kitu so I know when it's too high and there are some people I give intentionally high just taki kwa sorry but <laughs> kwa <laughs> now eh because unajua tutasumbuana like yes. for example in my whatever I'm like this brand I won't give them value so that ni sisemeni mm. nilikata acha tuniseme hivyo wengine wanafika bei mm. then you are like we now what to okay do? guys let me tell you the truth <laughs> <laughs> yeah, but but I think uh, in terms of worth is the value that I'm because mm-hmm. I just don't want your money cuz if uh, uh, there's like there's someone I told Juzi yeah. to we were like we did a research and then we are like we're not going to give them value because of what they wanted we don't have that kind of um tutakula pesa yao bure in short mm. so we're like uh, to be honest we cannot be able to mm-hmm. deliver on this but if i feel what i'm giving you is worth it it's worth of that money then that's how i know this is worth so first things first is has it taken care of production or has it taken care of um, we call it the opportunity cost yes. like for example if i take product a they are the different let's assume this is different mm-hmm. but they are the same area yeah so the, <laughs> let's assume they are not the same so if i'm taking this product to push i'm foregoing maybe yao walikuwa wananifikiria yes. ni vile walikuwa wanataka kuniongelesha next week yes but because i've picked this one i won't be able to pick that one it's a risk on its own it's a risk and if i pick that one i won't go again and pick, pick that one, one after two weeks yes I, i find that as a so that's something else i tell whoever it is my worth iko hivi so that's worth that one a control mm. but kuna ingine, like for example for 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 youtube you cannot yes. be able to control, control. Eh, so you need the amount of input your putting sasa ni wewe ujipange mm-hmm. hapo so it's to know am i taken care of am i okay because kuna jobs zingine unachukua gaza free mimi kuna job upi gaza free of my own kuna vile mu angalia nasema iwacha tupige is it mm-hmm. a cost that i'd want to support i'm like eh hey, hey, mm-hmm. freely given freely lend uh-huh. so i'm like tupige eh, kuna ingine hapa na hawa matoke eh, exactly mm-hmm. so every day there is someone new yeah. every day and um, the, 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 there is something to consider kwa sababu kila mtu wako ako ni nini kivi yake and agencies uh, i uh, personally oh, i don't want there's a nini si kukuambia yes. nini si jakuambia na si kiburi hey. because i think heshima ni muhimu idumu so I, i i work with this client for over three years right then ni madara to it's like they see the value but they like hi unajua hata atuoni nini ai hata tuna leads eh manzi but uko ndani when they meet where can we get in jugush to go next wanakupangia juu wanajua what it does for them so yes. this time this lady anakuja we've been working well with this company this lady she's a new lady amekuja now guys na ile kirere yetu which is good but akanikanyaga miguu so she came and we were like tuna nini negotiate contract i'm like it's it's not in the foregoing it's not uh, sustainable because we are doing a lot and f- the agreement was yes let's try and see what can work out now it's working out we cannot continue because what we are doing i was going back to my pocket mm. and i i pay for production and to naipiga it was not sustainable so i'm like eh kama ni hivyo eh alinikalisha chini akaniambia unajua nini creatives hamnanga pesa unajua hamnanga jobs Oh, wow. So you should take this. You actually you are actually uh, the Something most expensive. The, no, you are the most expensive we have. Nikambi acha nikwambie. You are the least paying. No, you are the least paying. Like if I was to do this for money hata zingekuwa na nyinyi hiyo miaka 4. You are the least. Mm. So umeniambia sisi creative atunanga pesa. 
ah ah tunanga job mm. you know you don't come by this every so often you creatives at least take this niliambia <laughs> zele oh. sasa eh tupatane kwa parking good so sele is like ah ah mm-hmm. so wakan even the contract release ya hapo mm. anakambia mdosi jum dosi ni mtu tunaongea nikambia sasa mm. watu wako yes Eh, sidhani mimi niko na roho ya kuendelea because we should be able to respect each other mm. whatever because what i'm doing it's and especially if you seen the, the 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 value that i'm giving i i think it's just like any other job eh wewe ita mtu umwambie sasa unajua kwa hii kampuni wewe ndio tunalipa match mm. mm. na unajua unaweza kapa kapa juu sioni uko nje kama utapata kazi wacha niende nikose yes. yeah, yeah so so i think in terms of your, you you can be able to feel to, it yeah. and you can be able to the, the, the only disservice and that's why i'm saying this the only disservice with what you do is that it's not quantifiable you know if i'm selling this cup for 2000 ndio niacha ujinga because it's quantifiable yes. vikombe kama hizi zinakuaga for so three so there eh eh juni ni supu maybe na kunywa maji you get eh inakuaga no hii yako si three so hii ukaanza kuuza by the way eh uanza kuuza jeshi yako watanunua hata dawa next year eh so my point is some things are quantifiable but what we do mtu anakuambia hai na kulipa hiyo pesa yote ku MC na unasimama 2 hours eh hey, but lazima ulipie huko nyuma yeah. yeah. juu how lipi tu hiyo time yeah. Eh, kama ni hiyo time naweza kuja na nisimame au lipi hiyo time yeah. when a doctor a physician doctor our the specialist wana charge what they are charging mm. you're not paying at a i daktari hata hujanikata sana umenishona uzi sita you're not paying for that <laughs> you are paying you unaweza kufa ukiwa kwa hiyo kitu you're paying for the experience you're yes. paying for the investment this doctor Yeah. has already been done. Mm-hmm. Eh hey, ate tunalipa flight hapa mm. ni nini na ni kutoka hapa ningechukua gari si chukue si gari. gari. You get my point. Yeah. So there is what you're paying for and your worth and especially if you're going to make money. And this this is what I say. If you're going to make money then let me make money. Mm-hmm. Eh hey, but kuna watu they're not going to make money. Yeah. Their courses like for example uh, T21 there's a group I support called T21. The, 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 I do that without wanting anything in return. It's freely given, freely lent. Mm. Yeah, but cannot be freely given yes. then you make, you money. make money. Like it's it's no, only it's fair. True. It's only fair. And, and I'm glad a lot of people have supported that both mm. corporates and SMEs. Mm-hmm. Um b- b- because I feel even for the current generation of of content creators bread and butter is in corporates SMEs yes. um AdSense mm. uh, pia ina inacheza mm-hmm. but i feel we are in a very good space because kitambo you couldn't be able mm-hmm. to have these conversations mm. of what why are you paying this this much why are you yeah. paying this one this much but all in all god name so mm. and i love that a lot mm. of creatives are now beginning to know their worth mm. but allow me to address this with you because i know you are creative mm. and i would love your input mm. in it mm. i always i've had a couple of stories that involve agencies mm. personally I, as i was saying i don't mm. work with agencies mm. i take up maybe three or four clients mm. in a year mm. that, because i know as you were saying mm. i can give them value mm. but it's very hard for me to work with agencies is mm. because past experiences have not been very friendly mm. and i always feel like that is something both corporates and uh agencies they have to work together mm. on because mm. i don't know why we've normalized having agencies stay with people's money for three or four months mm. i i don't know what your thoughts are but i believe in a growing economy that is something that also should be talked about but if mm. maybe if you've mm. had a different experience and mm. i would love to hear that allow me to not talk about that mm. but to talk about very much no <laughs> <laughs> So thing is uh, <laughs> thing is um this is a, a discussion of that because it's it's very it's very important to have an agency but at the same time it is, seems not very important. Yes. Very important because they break down they break down the messages that the client wants mm-hmm. to because at times as a client nataka hiki to use but see yeah. you how to message it yes. see you how to go about it see you who to choose to be able to apply mm-hmm. you know me yangu ni product making the product yangu yeah. sio hii So there is that. So there are some agencies or there are agencies what they're supposed to do is break that down and to be a link between now where uh, they as the as the creator mm-hmm. um and how this message will be disseminated. It's all good on paper. 
until now to come umeshachapa job yako umeharakishwa na, na concept notes yes. nini nini alafu sasa kulipwa wamesema tungoja 90 days mm-hmm. 90 days inafika ule mwenye anafaa ku sign is not there ana kwa kwangu hapa like there ame fly out and now what happens it mm. frustrates you as a creator because you have invested we go over and beyond unaleta cast unaleta crew so what you have to do now jua hujalipwa wanasema we don't do 50% yeah and the thing is client they, they don't 50% do. am i the only person who asks for 70 down payment for yeah, whatever client client amelipa yote eh, client amel kwani kwa wao ni wa yesu <laughs> how loving can they be like i'm talking of things that i've known and i'll, yes. I'll tell you how i knew so amelipwa so kwani mimi asini so you are getting money off your pocket to pay these guys it's money maybe you may borrow Whatever you borrow maybe na accrue interest ama unashinda ukiambiwa udiniambia aje unaongoja 90 days you are told it's it's chaotic so this one agency gave me a job or a client alisema tunataka njugusha mm. through the agency of course they mm. came tukafanya job vizuri on this one end of the bargain tunafanya poa you were called to the meeting you go you have your notes you send your script or your concept note you should deliver hey client alipenda then starts the game hmm. when are you going to say they said we wait for the, when are you going to pay you it became tiring so they stayed with that money for six months then the same client came back ah jugush was so good eh? now we want to have him for the next six months eh? they called me so kuna hii brief ya ni nani tujai lipo mm. So client anasema so the, these guys how I escalate your matter so client anajua jugusha shao ngeleshwa i cannot wait to see so the client we met somewhere randomly to mungu na yani wa chambu na wakutai so we met randomly alafu client ananiuliza um how are you i can't wait to see your script eh? i'm not a script gani hamjatulipa pesa ya six months ago what do you mean and we cleared everything for them kumbe walilipwa do yote mm-hmm. Someone told me they take the money some rogue whatever agencies take the money put it in money markets yes wewe sasa ngoja pesa izae upewe yako so they've made their money or they take this money for this project wanalipa huyu maybe akulipa 50% yeah. they nini so it's a chain of na sisi mm. tunarudi so 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 it's chaotic so if you can be able to work with the client directly well and good um and it's 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 coming now to you as a creator because what you're doing as an agency mm. is to be able to break down this message in a palatable manner for the masses and whatever they want to achieve however lean mini mejua my audience mm. i know what they want and that's yes. why i can say see is chukua product flani yes. i know how to talk to them mm. i've done on ground activation tumeenda pale TNT watu wa sita waka come tumefanya on ground activation kama ni billboard ni kupiga tuwekele i know how to media buy mm. um, i am coming up with the concept of how i want your campaign to run i have six videos umenipati i do i have six videos nimekugawanisha nimekwambia what i'm doing is sort of a makas small agency mm-hmm. for myself yes because ultimately ita, itafika hapo mm-hmm. because currently there are some agencies si work now si semi ni wabaya but For, due to past experiences yeah eh, cuz i don't understand mm. and as you said it needs to be worked out from maybe clients you pia kuna wengine clients pia wanaka mm. kutoa do na unapata is a big client so they cannot really push so they look for other means mm. to get that money mm. so i also feel them but it's somehow but kitu haita wai kuangusha ni adsense good eh hiyo ikifika nini hamsumbuani ikifika 20 something uh, 26 26 hata wanaku wanatuarakisha adsense yes. go slow unafika nini wamekuarakisha so yeah. the direct and i'm happy meta now pia umeanza ku monetize mm-hmm. because now that means hiyo kitu ya kutegemeana ni mbaya sana but when you are in control proper control of your exactly revenue exactly i think that's it ingine iko secondary when you mm. proper control you have your own uh, whatever you control everything sema hii wiki tutakuwa na 3 tunaweza ongeza you are at your own pace sio hii unafanya kitu na mbwa ai what is that he has done mm-hmm. you get na manzi umepiga umejitolea na na wali approve script uh, then we are this is like not what kama. we were talking about some guys wali na... approve script sasa zile nime post they have said you you pull it down ah i'm like relax my dear sister kwani unakuja na pressure yes 
Hiki <laughs> tumeko back and forth na tuma script mm. na, na, na shoot muka approve na ndio email nikamwambia story <laughs> sit as he pull down okay but can you okay I, it's bringing problem nikamwambia put it in writing period eh yeah, ju lazima ulipie hiyo yes. sit will shoot yes uh, so i think even for creators out there being able to have that direct mm. um, access to your money and to your revenue and being able and nowadays people are very supportive kenyans and and the beyond are very supportive in what you do mm. they are like ah ah wewe weka number even generally even not even in terms of content creation unaona mtu ame ame trend mali yako na shida anauza number yake number ni gani eh why yes. it's because even the wakenya wako wakenya mm-hmm. they are very generous they so appreciate. they appreciate what you do. and if you are putting work they are seeing they are seeing they and are willing by the way do you know you don't need millions no, at don't. at kila mwezi mimi eh una need to hiyo wase wanakupatia and whatever ad sense and whatever so yes. if you have a way of 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 having your own revenue streams be it merchandising be it whatever it is iko sawa it's good eh if you can go ahead and do other things that are supported like for example i have a bus mm. Yeah, yeah, Mr. Kamau. Yes. If you can be able to do that and you in a nini uko, then you don't Diversify. need Diversify. Eh, yeah, because kama ile time ya COVID when nothing is happening, where do you go? Umezo ya corporates. Corporates ni wapoa and we really appreciate. But, but also to substitute that. Uh, Alisema billionaire kwa ngi billionaire na one stream of revenue. Ukweli. Yeah, so you need to, to have a lot. Yes. Hiki kuja unaambia I'm sorry I cannot be able to do that. I'm shooting LNS the whole of this week. Yeah, yeah. Can you wait? Mhm. True story. Okay, saba. But so, sikai sana tutangoja next week. Yes. Which is good. Which is It's good. Bal- eh, otherwise tutakufa na stress. Mm-hmm. Yeah, kutegemea you have not paid for 90 days. Yep. And that is messing a lot of people too much. Too much. You you, you know kuna mm. ka, kuna ka one two one kana kama. So acha tanchukue mkopo hapa. Wacha nichukue sijui nini. Ah, we will pull it up then so, whatever. So before you know it's it's, mm. it's messing your mm. mind. And it's good money but mm. it will get you off track of getting your own things going i think the mental instability is not worth it mm. but ttnt5 mm-hmm. reject mm-hmm. right mm-hmm. in in a world or in a space where some people are so scared mm. of checking the government mm. you've made it your business to speak out and even using your art to point out mm-hmm. things that mm-hmm. you are not okay with mm-hmm. in this country mm-hmm. first and foremost how are you feeling where are we i saw you posted Uh, there was um info track i believe mm-hmm. they 77% mm-hmm. uh, there was a poll and 77% said they don't believe kenya is going towards the mm-hmm. right direction do you believe that actually i think i don't believe that i think we are more we are more oh. more than the 73% because mm-hmm. eh, i think for the first time first of all i'm very happy when when i was doing political commentary or whatever you want to call it what do aku anaongea sana but I was convicted freely given freely lent if one day because these people support you but how do you when you go to i don't know about your dm na kwanza yako inakaa kuwa mbaya sana si na maboys na sema na nini na story story eh mtu anakuambia manzi mama yangu ako hivi ako hosi manzi na hiyo ni kitu inafaa kuwa na shukrani na gava mwingine anakuambia manzi sina job kwanza za job ni mingi i cannot be able to help Mwingine manzi nafaa kwenda chuo sasa chuo sasa zile pay bill niko nazo za chuo unasikia university pay bill yangu ni hii and then you see they go ahead and implement a, a, a band one for five that is not working they're making it worse so my point is i am not political actually mimi politics uh, i don't think i'd ever join politics yeah. but speaking for what is just because what i'm saying is the truth and you can see what has happened now if there's a time kenya tuko sawa yes inji iko mbaya but tuko sawa why is because people have realized their voice or may realize aya mpishi kama hiki tutakuwa rakisha because sisi ndio tunasi you know all along after election tunakaga tunaomba e mweshu situache hivyo o mweshu kuja mbele ya kanisa e kama e, e mweshu kaja na kuja it's supposed to be the other way ile time ya before election that's who the mweshu is anakuja kwenye kukula gedheli kwa kibanda sasa hapa ndio mnatulianga mm. huyo ndio mheshimiwa kama anataka kuheshimiwa mheshimiwa sio huyu anajali mambo yake when it's their things wanajaa bunge <coughs> eh, but when other things are being discussed hawakuji na wakikuja wamelipwa you remember what happened with the finance bill walikam wakachangapa eh hey, tuna vote hey, but people stood up and said yeah no because people and 
I, I keep saying when Gen Z went out, we didn't want or they didn't want leadership. They didn't want to be in leadership. They just wanted people to act right. So that even whoever comes next, whether old or young, because Pia Tugmekana kwa na vijana wame tuangusha, they go and wana kuwa sucked into the system. Yes. What we wanted is leadership that is accountable, that is responsible. When vitu wazi endi poa, mnasema wazi endi poa. It's white and black. And I'm happy right now with the social media was up. Do you know what's up? Yes. Your mother will tell you, eh, nidiona what's up? Mm. Eh, kai, wanasema tena wanataka kuangeza eh, tam. Seven Nashindu, years. Ay, uliona wapi? Eh, niliona, ni mtandao. Eh, Wanaitaga mtandao. Mtandao. Ni mtandao. Ni mtandao. Eh, so, people are woke and are not afraid. You've said people are afraid, but people mm. now can be able to talk what they are feeling. Because more than ever, na mungu waki, when he wants to make you mad, mm-hmm. mitiote huteleza. Like, all of a sudden, you have to realize all these people are the same. Hakuna mzuri. All these people, yeah. provided you are checked, kuna mali ume, umeangaliwa. Na hizi shida unanoa kona hazo ni za pesa. Kuna pesa wana itijana. Yes. Eh, kuna pesa imekuja hapa, kuna pesa haiku kuja, nikuwe na fai kuja. Unajua nilitoa pale, so inafai rudi. Ni mambo ya wana itijana. Juzi ni kaski another MP. Um, I think ilikuwa somewhere, kapsa, kapsa retro somewhere. Mm. A visiting MP ya kasema, um, ati hivyo vita iko juwa cha neni na ayo, ni yao. Nini mko huku chini okoteni yoi ko chini? aliambiwa ah, ah, ah. kwa nini tunaokota hiyo iko chini na hiyo iko juu mnakula ni yetu yeah so i think once people realize there because all we want is by the way do you know if we had education that iko sawa ewe mtoto unazaa naenda kama juzi nimeona mtoto yako form 1 amefukuzwa fees why ah man that was primary super. school high school um, and i'll take you back to primary school mm. primary school high school um, university mtoto yana fasome bila kulipishwa na kama ni kulipa ni kidogo kama ile mm-hmm. university yenyewe walikuwa mm-hmm. nilipa kidogo acha na hiyo umechange then after hapo um, health mimi sitaki madhesa zile um, old age na mkimbiza na magonjwa na ita mabeshto wangu tuchange mm. we don't need to have a lot of whatsapps za kuchanga while well, hawa kigonjeka hakunaga hapa nje mm. eh yes, sisi kuna beshto yetu alienda dubai mwezi tatu <laughs> sisi ni hapa sisi kinaumania hapa na ukienda hizo public whatever ile line iko utapenda ni uenda kama Hauko na haraka ya kukufa yes. utuli hapo. So, when we take care of all those things, eh, barabara ikuwe poa, mm-hmm. eh, everything works, then hakuna makelele utasikia. People just want good leadership. The, the reason why Gen Z waliongea, wakasema wamelipwa. Wakasema wamelipwa. Na basi wenye alikuwa na lipana, alikuwa na pesa. Mm. Kama alilipa watu na anaendelea kualipa. Eh, mm. na anaendelea kualipa. Yes. Sasa wazazi wao nao wanasimama wanasema kama mbaya mbaya. If you if you saw the public participation we had a lot of older generation. Yes, we did. Eh, walitokea wakasema mm. eh, waliua watoto wetu. Sasa sisi ndio tuna, tutaongea. Yeah. There is something wrong. Mm-hmm. And we are to, we, we, we are talking about that we are not talking about poly because for the longest time Kenya tumeambiwa usionge siasa. What a, you know siasa I, mbaya maisha mbaya. Can I tell you something? Mm. I think I know 99% of the people appreciate when we bring civic education mm. and thought provoking mm. conversations but I can't tell you I've not seen one or two comments where someone has said where wachana na politics yeah, this will be the me. stick to what you your stories mm. this will be the end of you mm. and it bothers me because I'm like is shift politics Mm, I know. Is education politics? Is hunger politics? Mean roles? Is ma- like we are going through so many things mm. and we really need to decolonize our mind. These things are not politics. Mm. Our politicians have made these things to be mm. because they affect you. Shift is mm. affecting every one mm. of us right now. Mm. When you talk about it, someone says wachana na politics. Mm-hmm. That shows how much decolonization need. we need mm. to There's a guy who I've met a lot of those who are DM. So first of all wanaongea vibaya kwa mtandao yeah. ndiye. So kwa mtandao akasema stick to what you do was comedy. Kasema ni sawa, I, I hear you ni sawa. Em um, siku jibu. Mm-hmm. I go by majority wanasema ni. Yeah. You meet someone me actually kuna client alinipigia akasema manzi usiwache. Yes. Cuz unajua a lot of people fear kama basi mnaogopa ku lose. Yeah. Do. Who ni client? Who ni audience? Who else do you want apige hiyo muhuri? Kama wamepiga. Eh. Hey, hey, na audience. Audience yes. imesema by the way zile unapiganga. Ai 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 ni tamu sana. Mm. So and even reverend wangu akaniambia hiyo iko sawa. <laughs> Toa kengine. Gusa. 
you 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 get and if you see even right now the yeah. men of the clergy wanaongea mm-hmm. eh yeah, kuna father sik ananibamba sana wanaongea yes. they, they are speaking mm-hmm. so for these guys u jamaa kaongea akasema ni achane na siasa then juzi i posted that mze the same guy mzuri wangu naye mungu amenipatia akili or rather see akili actually ni twitter the search engine ya ni deadly <laughs> So mimi kipata DM yako ukiniambia kitu kwanza muenda na search. Huyu ashaongea nini kunihusu so that nijue tuko wapi. Because yes. again watu hatujua. Yep. Wengine hey, wanipata jamaa alikuwa ameniambia sasa ni wewe waas do eh, what you do as. Eh. Eh, sasa anataka unfortunately mamake amekuwa ill anataka usaidizi. So kile alikuwa anataka nikamnini alafu nikamtumia screenshot. Ah. Nikamwambia kama serikali inge kama mambo ingekuwa poa kwa health sector EDM haungetumia he was so sorry and he was like me you kwa hiyo time mm. unajua nini nini so mm. I, i don't take it kwa personally, kwa, eh, personally eh, but kitu nime realize do you know na ina, ina fail eh? mm. these people have been using two things um, tribe and power and money so tribe itakuwa unajua ha, watu walitudanganya ni sisi tuna kama saa hii yeah um i mambo ya mlima mlima <laughs> i mambo ya mlima mimi i'm like hakuna mzuri Yes. Eh, ni hao anajua kila wanaitishana. Mm. Kwa nini wamekaa hivyo wakachukiana? Kuna kitu wanaitishana. Yes. Tunajua the end of the day sisi hatuko hapo. Wakati vijana waliuliwa githurai and everywhere hatukuwaona githurai. Mm. Sasa zile wameanza kubishana ndio wanaenda githurai. Yes. Te watu wangu. Mimi si mtu wako. So they've used tribe. They've also used money. money. That's why unasikia mm. ha vijana walilipwa. Juu wanaamini habuwezi enda bila kuli Kulipua. because that's what they use they use mm-hmm. money mm-hmm. ukitaka wabunge wapige kura toa nini pesa, pesa. hawezi piga bila pesa yes. so that's what they believe unfortunately people watu ni, ni, ni wapia yeah. and people have really been wamefunguka they like na nilijua watu wamefunguka you remember during election yes. kuna mtu fulani alidanganyana sijui wapi akamwambia uongo uongo hiyo yep. eh hapo if you can be able to tell them uongo you have watu hawananga yeah. nini there's another guy niliona inakuru niki nini malizia mm-hmm. Najua ni mkuu ya school. Sikao na niangalia vibaya. Sikola. Sikola kwa gaiki kitamaliza. So Acha na school. They was an MP. They were booed. Hey. Walikuwa kwa mazishi. Uh-huh. They were booed alafu akaanza kusema tutawatengenezea barabara. I'm like you that's not a favor. It's what you're supposed to do. Lin siezi kuja hapa nikupigie makofi. Eh hey, Lin manzi. Yaani mme switch on camera. Wow. It's what you should do. Absolutely. Eh, so ate manzi tutawekea barabara it's long overdue. It's not a favor. Ate mwingine sasa ndio anaanza kujua Mungu. Ate sasa tulikuwa tumekuja hapa mazishi. Sasa ndio umejua tumekuja mazishi saa zile umepigiwa kelele. Jua na mbe uongo toka hapo. Na mbe okay. Bwana asifiwe. Jua na jua hamtasema toka hapa. Yes. Wacha neni na Mungu, wacha neni na pesa. Uh, right now we just want service delivery. Hii story nyingine mm. eh, na 2027 ni kama ni wanaiba waibe saa hii because 2027 i think is going to be different najua tunasemaga wa Kenya we need a lot of civic education watu watarudisha tu wale people are gullible is true but i think we are better than we were mm. like five years ago i think we are way mm. better mm. Do... we are better sasa ni mm. shida tu kidogo inaingia na hastaki watu tusahau mm. tukisema aki woye wanamsukuma yes woye wanamtoa eh, wanamuimpi yes, wanajua kile wana ni wanaitisha na eh yes eh, wanajua so ni tufunguke macho na mm. tusiseme hakuna because hiyo ni kitu kingine tunasema sasa alternative ni gani alternative ziko nyingi if at all We, like for example and, and uh, this is an example it's yes. not paid yeah. like someone like Kivuda Kibwana oh. I'm not saying he's the best but would wewe ukiwa hapo nyumbani five years ago ungempatia chance ama ungesema ni kutupa unaje utasema gani unaje huyo hata chaguliwa kwa nini and things this is the time exactly i think this is the time we need to ask ourselves those questions because all i want is for my kids to have a better future mm. that's all mr kiwongozi i hate to be a politician too, man. Eh, but i just want to see justice i just want to see mm. people get unaendaga nchi zingine manzi unashindwa guy yani mnakaa graffiti tell them tell them man manzi unaenda ah. unashindwa nimeenda hosi you are like guys sasa huko nimeenda hosi na ni exchange rate ni mbaya yes unaambwa uko sawa ai eh umeletwa public ukiwa hapo ndio una realize ni public hospital na inakaa yenyu ya hapa private yeah first world eh mm. so so i think na si vitu hatuwezi if you are affording to fill all those gazlas if you are affording kuweka ofisi haziko mtu wako na advisors kama kumi na hahitaji achukue advice if you are affording <laughs> very unnecessary positions then hakuna kitu hatuwezi fanya mm. you unload <laughs> mm. no 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 ni nimeongea uongo no If we are affording all that, 
then aki tunaweza afford hosi fit. Yeah. Cuz we don't want much. Tunataka kitu very functional. We don't want much. Kama mm. sasa hivi kuulize mtoto wako akitoa layo unafurahia akitoa mangu nyeri hai. Hizo ni shule fit ya kitu wa catch mega. Hiyo ni chuo poa. But kwa nini unataka ende primary ya ya, ya gava? Yep. Kuna ka disconnect. Kuna ka disconnect. ECD at least wameanza ali childhood development the the whatever but also yeah. my sh- zinafazi ya kwefiti because it hurts me when for primary school kupeleka mtoto academy is is a status symbol uh-huh, uh-huh. and endaga sijui nani academy na yeah. drop you on a bus we should not be dropping a bus we should be going to those public schools because kitambo how we used to go to school ni every village iko na shule public school no, we to primary utafiti kandengwa we didn't need well we could have used buses but we didn't need them juu shule iko pale yes why it's because it's the prerogative ya gava kukuwa na shule sasa hivi unaenda shule unaambiwa ni 190 You are like for what a copy p2 190 hiyo ni pesa ingepelekwa kwa that's why tuna live hand to mouth juza ile kidogo inapatikana mtoto aenda shule sunday tuende tucheze ba kule chipo turudi tena haraka kabla pesa ishe hand to mouth loan saa hii watu wanakuwa kwa loan unachukua hii unalipa hii unachukua hii unalipa hii hii unawazimia simu you get why it's because some of these things jaribu uonjeke you are one sickness away mkuwe bankrupt Munauza shamba kuna DM mob sana watu wananiambia manze and it hurts me mtu anakuambia tu tu advertise hii shamba eh madhiri anataka kwenda India I'm like no hiyo ni kitu tunaweza fanya hapa you saw some one akiwa mgonjo anapeleka madaktari wanapata nanga kwenye anaenda yes. why you guys anaenda wa London yes. then mtu atakuja hapa kukwambia wewe okota yo it, it hurts me how they think of us and that's what hurts me how lowly they think of us Eh hey, ni pesa. Te mkizusha ni watu wako na pesa, waliona hiyo narrative i work. Ile ya kusema mnakuja na maji ya chumvi, mm. ya chupa sasa wakaanza wamelipwa. Mm. Yo. It was sponsored, very sponsored. Yes. Juu kuna wazazi walikuwa wanapatia watoto wao for the fair. Unamwambia wewe enda bora ukuesive. That's sponsoring. Mm. My father na ni mchungaji. Aliniambia usikae nyumbani wanaume wengine wakiwa nje. Wow. Nikatoka mchungaji So it was very sponsored. Kwanza hiyo ilisponsorwa na Holy Holy Spirit. <laughs> <laughs> the Holy Spirit. So uh, let's not dream. people are feeling the pain. Yes. And sijui nini ufanyika ukienda huko juu unasahau. Maybe KJ atuambie. <laughs> <laughs> I have no idea. By the way sijui ukienda huko you forget the people kabisa totally. Mm-hmm. People are going through stuff. Na tujisemeshi hivi to sound woke. People are really going through it. Yeah. If you go machinani you will you understand. Ukikuja hey, Nairobi you will understand man. people are going through through mm. maneno. And uh, long and short of it is let's do what is right. Is it too much to ask? Eh unafaa ufanye hivi. Na hamwezi tuambia hakuna do na tunaona vile mnaishi. Umeona kuna MP fulani wa huko Eldoret. MP ya staki kutanja ako na pesa mpaka imefika mahali ana point wazee na mkwaju ako na pesa unashindwa hai yani kimaksudi tu unashindwa huyu mtu ako na convoy ya gari kama sita before election ako hiyo na sisi si wajinga mm. wenyewe waliketi chini wakasema wanavaa belt za pesa ngapi so kama nyinyi mko hivyo kwa nini mkenya anaumia yep. how many people have to die na even after all that nyao tena wanajisabazia wewe kuja Umekuwa ida side kuja nikupe hawa tutulize hawa Sima. watu. Eh sini alikuwa na Twitter tuongee awe kuja. Eh kuja tugawane si wamenyamaza. Bora useme ya Danny is reputable. Mm. You see? Kosawa. You see and, and I'm like yo it's it's, it's na ukiangalia hiyo budget wameongeza sijui na that is something billion. Mm. Whatever K eh, K eh, eh, walikuwa wamesema ilikuwa 60 something billion. Sasa wanasema haita ah, nini na 95. Yo, tunaona hizi vitu na sisi wajinga and i think we have our priorities priority ya impeachment is that ilikuwa priority no. but him be wako nayo if you were to do hizo vitu zingine unakumbuka mbio jeshi iliwekwa nayo jeshi litolewa lakini uzuri jeshi nao ni wafiti uh, yes. jeshi walitoka wakasema yeah. ah tuende hata yeah. kuna jamaa alikigua video akikula jaba akajua <laughs> hizi ni stories za jaba yes. the, they, they went out then the next day wabunge wakarauka asubuhi na mapema wakasign mm. eh, jeshi itoke 
which is not supposed to happen yeah. so ile mbio wako na all you asking is in bio wako na ya kufanya vitu zao hata zetu watukumbuke zetu zisifike mbio wakati tunamaliza mm. term ndio mm. tunakuja sasa tulikuja hapa hamkukuja hatutaki mm-hmm. all you want ni mfanye kazi God. na saa hii tumejua you all the same na Mungu ni mzuri amewaonyesha ya turn code everyone is the same as long as hapa umeangaliwa uko sawa yani unataka kuniambia johore aka kwa gaba ya rutore na minero eh hebu <laughs> niambie <laughs> ki minero eh wewe in what world na usimjiambia ate ni Mungu amemuongeresha hakuna maybe ni god eh so sisi maybe ni god mm, sisi na hiyo mtu wetu <laughs> and, and something also i love about this generation is yeah. wengine wamezaliwa na intermarriage so unajipata yes. ujui kwenye ujui wewe ni wa wapi mm. two people are very work eh watu wamesoma Yeah, kibaki alitusomesha bure watu wamesoma so people know what is right and what is wrong yes. that's what we are saying tunasema mm-hmm. what is right and what is wrong then there is this term gen z nikimalizia eh, because when we use it kosawa but when they use it ni ya ku condis- it's condescending mm. unajua anasema ni watoto mm. unajua hawa watoto gen z studia uh-uh. when eh, walikuwa wanapigania uhuru hakuna mzee alipigania uhuru na mkojo walikuwa vijana Eh walikuwa vijana hiyo wakati wakipigania uhuru wanaingia huko hawajui kama watatoka kwa msitu walikuwa vijana so mtu asikwambie we ni mtoto a uh-uh. a wow. are you speaking what is right then iko sawa na haukosi adabu hakuna mtu unakosea adabu then nikimalizia ya mwisho kabisa it's okay, it's okay. these people unajua wana act gini kama hii kazi tuliwalazimishia mm. hata akichukua mp sio walikuja wakaomba kama kiti ni moto toka Jua natuambia sasa mnataka aje tunaleta hii hatuna pesa ya kutosha ndio maana tumetafuta adani sasa mnataka tu kama kazi imekushinda toka wachia mtu atafanya hii kazi eh hey. hey. they were not acting ni hey. kazi liwa fair hey. ni kama eh hey, wanatufanyia favor ati guy we sima ma mp wo ye okay basi chukua cs akichukua hii kazi mlienda kwa magari mkitafuta kura mkaamwaga pesa yenu mkazunguka yes. so kazi kikushinda mtoke mimi if i want to be a president First of all kinyongo irudi I'm sorry to say but kinyongo irudi because ah watu wa aski yangi eh juu unapata kama juzi kuna jamaa ameinuliwa alikuwa amewekewa nini ya mabilioni alikuwa na kashfa tulichezwa mbona eh kidogo kidogo ameinuliwa si wali vote vile wali vote na unajua sasa kwa bunge unapiga uongo simu sasa kama uko na kesi kwambia lini ile kesi yako ndio itoke si vote hiyo sawa inaenda hivyo anyways taki kwenda huko but all yeah. I'm saying is Ora I'm saying is kama kazi imekuwa ngumu kama leo kaamua hapa ushindi wa kazi simnafunga toka eh toka Funga mtu mwingine anakama hapa inapigwa yes. mimi leo nikisikia sitaki kufanya kazi kwenye niko maybe niko ina company somewhere imagine kuna kuja mtu mwingine mu deadly kukuliko eh, so kama kazi imekuwa ngumu toka. pia vijana ni wengi wamesoma mm. na wazee pia ni wengi wamesoma they have experience but they're not given chances because they don't bow down to hiyo they maybe don't know politics ni kunywa maji yes Does... <laughs> oh? kuna watu mpaka sahi hawana maji mbiwa mm. hawana kimbia hapa we have known this person is not good kwako hakuna maji anyway Wait, Sko. does does Sko karibu kumaliza eh uh, does being a dad mm. fuel does it fuel you a lot. you being a dad do you know if i didn't now? have kids me i think singe kuwa na shughuli mo because i'm looking at these kids i'm like where i am now kuna time nilikuwa mtoi na siko najua i'll be responsible for my parents follow other things and for the kids if i found better education system mm. better health ninge kuwa na less pressure if i found videos zimetengenezwa ninge kuwa na less pressure Juni ngakuwa achuo anaenda fiti hosi anatengenezwa tukupoa so ile ndio tuko nayo tu invest ama tufanye kitu kingine we could have be, we could be living better lives so uh, that hiyo inaniumaga sana and also pe- seeing pain ya watu wengine pia hiyo ina have you ever mm. been so helpless how is this idea man hata mimi sasa hii hey, you're like ara kufungua dm ni shida mm, you're like man i feel you but siwezi and kuna mtu anafaa kufanya hivyo but they are all Anyway, no. sawa. But do you, do you, is there hope? Is there hope still? Oh, 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 hope iko and especially right now. I'm happy for these times we are living. This is going to be a, a, a beautiful change. It's not going to be business as usual. Mm. Eh, juu naona mtu analeta ukabila ambao acha ujinga wewe. Mwingine analeta pesa hatutaki. Kwanza sasa hizi pesa tukude. Juni pesa zetu anyway. Eh, hizi pesa zinarusha tunakula na unakonga hivi. Mm. Unajua kuna koti utatupeleka, tulikula yeah. pesa yako na tukufanya nini. So, um, there's a lot of hope because people 
are one people are tuko side yetu au wako side yao mm. mm. si wameji sasa for one wako wote mm. eh, isipokuwa sasa tena kashagua alitoka but wako wako wote wako same, same. Yeah. Eh, wako wote wako the same mm. yeah. so there is a lot of hope oh hope nayo i don't know if people are feeling that but there is that hope sasa ingia tu kwa matatu sema he guys mnaona <laughs> watakwambia tunakoja 2027 kila <laughs> mtu enda hata kanisa ukisikia mpaka mchungaji anaongea yeah. nasema unajua watakuja hapa na ni mimi wataomba microphone there is hope there is yes. a lot of hope good mm, mm, mm. i love i love this for us i love that we've decided mm. collectively mm. we are not going to be quiet mm. i love that other people who people of influence mm. are also using their platforms mm. to cause easy vita ya mtu mmoja mm. mm. this it's, we got to do mm. collectively and, and, and that's why atakusimama mm. atemi na simama that won't help much yeah vis-a-vis to, to this it's collective mm. atutaki hivyo mwenye anaingia hapo ajue Yeah. And people need to know when you talk about these things it doesn't mean you want to be in politics. Mimi hata mkanipe ya buri. Si wezi. Like you get it. Eh? <laughs> But <laughs> politics ni chafu especially here. Mm, mm, si wezi. Mm. Uh, I, I wezi. Yeah. Mm. But congratulations Thank on you. all your wins. Thank Do you, you want to so talk much. about the book? Oh, manzi na nimeisa pale chini manzi ndio kupatia. Yeah. So I have a book mm. called Whispers from my childhood. Eh <laughs> <laughs> growing up I was a very I'm a pastor's kid. My dad is a reverend. Mm. So you know there's the expectation ya watoi wa reverend wanafaa kuwa hivi, wanafaa kuwa hivi, a lot of pressure. So I was a normal kid in a pastor's house. So ilikuwa inaleta shida kidogo mushkil. So whispers mm-hmm. from my childhood is growing up in my early 90s I was born in 91. Yeah. So growing up in early 90s and and how my dad moving because my dad kept moving. Anapigwa transfer, I went to seven different primary schools. Mm. Anapigwa transfer. Actually I was born in Meru. Nikitoa ID yangu watu wanazaga. Kwa ni wewe ni Meru? Yeah. I'm like, ah, but I was born there. So mm. ah, sasa mimi sijui kama nafaa ni. Ni ni mrima. <laughs> Now. <laughs> eh, so, so all that uh, there are um, stories of my growing up, the inspirations mm. and why what i say now is influenced by what i saw then yes. having been able to see people from different walks of life go through different problems um so that's where uh, the whispers from my child i wrote it for one whole year naandika ai na pia editor na nini ai ai then this year nikaamua kama mbaya mbaya wa mm. so that's my first book of many i'm yes. now author wakiita na author nasimama bestseller yeah yeah yeah, yeah. <laughs> mungu asaidia so it's whispers from my childhood mm. mtu anaweza ipata njugushi.ke mm. it's both in physical to and, deliver around the country yeah. and also um ebook for the kindle wanaitwa kindle readers kindle. on amazon yes. yeah bado ziko hapo njugushi.ke mm-hmm. yeah, so mtu akienda yapate pale chukua hizi physical ziko signed yeah yeah oh, so wanasema eh, wasema okay. wanasema oh mimi nataka yangu ni sign yeah, yeah. 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 Uh-huh. hata kama sita isoma nitaiweka hapo nitaiweka ni ziwange yeah, but, but for the e guys wanazichukua sana because i realize also sikuizi watu wanasoma sana kwa nini na pia kusikiza yeah, mm. yeah yeah so whispers from my child mm-hmm. eh, enda uichukue ujione u- u- because and the reason why i wrote it is because of that story of PKs and also yes. the story of just basically 19 and how I was born mm. and what informs who I am and where I come from because what when I come like you are ready made product yeah but for you to get to understand who I am yeah. as a person so it's a true story of my whatever mm. Mm. of your journey mm. main congratulations uh, it's, my d- uh, it's my dream to author a uh, mm. book nisemange mm. atabibi i'm an author you yeah, have one hell of a story lady. ah you think so i have a beautiful story lady. you have a beautiful i think so mm. when time is right eh, eh, i know when no when pressure because i remember hey, nakumbuka gani your story kinichapia eh, your time ulikuwa ndio umerudi kenya yeah. you have a story and a half to yeah. live when time is right you, i think i hope Ate so you think ulikuwa ndio no. you think umekuona <laughs> I hope so yeah. you know but mm. it's really good to know mm. people like you in mm. this industry it makes it easier mm. when we see you 10 years mm. in mm. i think for me it's just a testament and also a testimony in mm. itself that mm. shikilia kitu god amekupea mm. itajipa True. ipo siku ah proper ipo, yani mimi sahi mtu akisema ita eh, itajipa mm. vile tu umesema i think with mm. time god makes all things beautiful mm-hmm. so it's only your basic na uongeze extra while at no, it extra. Eh, eh. by the way vile ulisema hawezi tu kuwa the same i tell when mm. i tell people hawezi kuwa the same talent we all have eh. talent by the mm. same what it kona mm. but skills mm. 
skills. Mm. That's where the difference is. True. Yo, me mm. always see that's actually where the difference is. Very Talent true. kila mtu kila mtu wako nayo. Eh, skill. Kil- skills. Mm. And that's why nilisikia uchungu nikisikia mm. kuna mtu alikuwa mahali manzea katuweka. It ilikuwa hapo 3 hours. Mm. So meeting brief hayezi anza bila eh. Mm. Manzea you know I'm a creative. Sio nikamuliza so. Like si elewi. So alafu hivi sasa yako na Abel itaisha lini? Ah, Abel akwenda huko. Yaani ni wetu. Ni kuna watu wengi Nairobi wanisuma. Wewe Abel si wetu. Angekuwa by them wenyu ndio uwezi mimi but yeye akwenda huko. For all he stands for. Ai. He's just chilly. By them was. Ni amuona ngi akinitukana. Ni saa zile naongea tu kidogo lakini but that's why kuna watu hata DM wanakujaga that's so wrong you couldn't have told him like that you know he meant at him. I'm like enda umwambie nimesema yani mjinga <laughs> so waenda kwake wanamwambia imagine please know that he's not your friend ana kutumia screenshot akicheck wewe manzetu ndakupeleka kwa code ana nitukana alafu ana mtumia no but i know we are joking people admire your friendship mm. your circle with akina feel and you eh, know they, they are good people are... and, and god gives you juu vile tumepatana na abel yes. ha- haikuwa tumepanga abel ziki yetu mm. nikimtutundi tupatana nake same with philo same with there are people same with akina but they are just people you meet yes and then they are not your family but for some weird reason you you that's why for, for some weird and i keep saying good people and bad people that's why your ethos and your whatever yes. blend the same way whatever you wanna join anga mukienda mazishi muranga na hujui huko muko na mulevi aki atajua chuo sote anakuja yako yako sote mtu wa bangi <laughs> mukienda na yeye hata wapi muende kipirigwe aki ya nani ataona mtu na atamsema na wataenda na atarudika amechomeka yep you so muna vuruta nanga so mm. you 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 know you, your uh, people fl- flocks of a feather yes bad together what <laughs> ah <laughs> bad 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 no you and your other no you and your other mic drop <laughs> sorry lapel drop <laughs> lapel, <laughs> lapel drop but yes. uh, man I'm, I'm i'm just excited to see the Thanks. 10 years ahead so soon we'll be talking about 20 years in the industry oh, most definitely you know see. but mm. i i am so so happy to see what god has in store mm. for you your family sele mm. umsalimi sana ya yeah, najua ipo siku tutahave a conversation together mm. umsalimie sana huyo hata ndakuletea hapa utamleta ndakuletea hapa kwa gari na umwambie tu leta hapa keti hapo muulize lini muulize swali ni muli ma you it's 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 admirable mm. what you guys have put out there na mimi okay. nasema mzidi mm. but i would be very 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 unfair not to talk about an event that i know is coming mm. we have a mark 6000 people mm at Sarit Center. Yes, do you yes. want to brief it's not an ad but mm. do you want to briefly touch on it? Yangu wa Mayabel. Touch to what I believe. So TTNT we did TTNT in in in, in um, Sarit Center on 27th of July. Yes. Kwa kama uli hata mazi it was so amazing. Yeah. I have never seen such love mazi. Kulifikisha mm. 6000. We we never saw that coming mm. sold out. It was it was amazing. Then sasa Abel na yeye ati kuna movie wana shoot. Mm kuna story nataka kupigia watu kuna concert wako nayo so they have mm. something they are calling the trinity yes. wako na vitu tatu yes. so abel apiga story zake mbaya mbaya um, there's a movie they are shooting a very amazing movie makosa ni yangu then they have a concert where wataleta wana muziki and mm. then it's gonna be amazing mm-hmm. happening on the 7th of december yes. pale sarit center mm. supportini abel asirudi ushago asirudi ushago mm. i asked you to talk about because i know you guys you move as family yes, but yes. like honestly mm. i i i loved and enjoyed your mm. success mm. but by the guys the details are on the screen mm. get your tickets i'll yes, also yes. put it on the community uh, but i really enjoyed the success of ttnt oh thank you five uh, thank you it spoke to so many people mm. what what do what should they look forward mm. to your seats me at this point because mm. partly of why we did it is mm. we need to let people know because tumekuwa kwa kija kuna watu tu wanafanya ngai hizo vitu like there is someone a very uh, prominent person in the industry alisema mimi siyezifanya event hiyo nini nikae kwa kwa skits hey, but you have creators who are coming up 
could want to do something similar. Mm. So kama njugusha aliambiwa hivyo, "Ai, mimi, uh, you go ahead and do it." Does that get to you when someone says wezi, wezi, wezi mfani? Kama kuna kitu God amenisaidia nikuchukua hiyo mm. to be able to wacha hiyo ikuchoche because pia watu wakikwambia lini uko poa uko uko poa uko poa by the way it's your downfall eh, eh wacha watu wakwambia ge ai naona galiz hiyo ndio inakupatia mm. motisha ya kuwa mm. wrong so i think for me that keeps me going and a lot of negativity kama ile time tulianza real houses kuna watu twitter hiyo time ilikuwa inaitwa twitter wakasema yes. eh look at this they want to be like lupita nyong'o wana tuletea kipindi ya mambot guess what Two weeks later lupita nyong'o wana tweet watching real houses of kawaii so who are you who are you eh uh, so my point is mm. niende sana mm. even the, the success of that show kwa sababu wengine you've seen what nani ame, amefanya and jemima it's crazy oh, because we have different audience mm. atakama ni same but different but they always show you show yes. for you see what kioko yes. wa, wanafanya yes. na kina mwalimu daktari mm. a lot of people are having shows sold out shows watu wana come yeah and nani nasra pia alikuwa na yake so because people like if, you paved uh, the way eh yeah, so if you able to show now there are a lot of people who don't want that to happen so if you are able to break that ceiling then that means everyone else will fly mm. everyone else ba kama ili ah yende yes, sana yende. exactly Good. so so i think i'm happy and also i'm supporting that like mm. abel so enda mm. pale madfan.com kwa ticket yako tupata ne kama nitaweza kukuja hiyo 7 kama <laughs> I might have that more important thing to do but it is but wewe ukisema ni kama mtaka kama hiyo hiyo hapo na 10k yangu naendea huko hiyo sawa uso nikuje nisaidie kuichukua huko kwa event si ndio binaona have me on the show i don't want to let you go maybe is there something else you want to add that you feel we've left out feel free no 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 it's just to thank guys for always supporting content creators not even me content creators because what you've seen is an uprise of a huge uh, selection of content creators who yes. are creating jobs who are doing something that's supposed to be done by someone else but we're not complaining we have productions running we have uh, managers we have makeup say mua is a thing kwa, kwa whatever kwa we have a lot of things going on courtesy of these and people are consuming kenyan content so shukran sana manzi continue supporting your best your because you might not find me as the best mm. but whoever it is that you are supporting continue supporting because through that support it will get to me you would never know but it will get to me like for example if if someone supports me and doesn't support abel mutua for example when they come to my show show yangu itaja itaonyesha client fulani na hizi show zimekuwa nyingi yes. na nani tena abel anataka kufanya yake junjugusha alifanya wacha nionge na abel ni muambie juni diona kile jugusha alifanya niona na abel kama ata nitawekelea hii pesa so hiyo kitu whether unataka ama utaki imefikia abel umenipata eh. and vice versa so eh. the more we are doing this the more we are having like you are having show do you yes. know your success is my success Good. because mtu akikuja on a lean guys hii ameweka ameona zako zote yes atatafuta next na zaona mm. ni si mimi nimebahatika yes. kama sio wewe hangeenda kwa hiyo youtube True. but now because they are there they are like ah wacha niweke ah jibush yes. wacha niweke so your success is my success my success is your success all our success mm. is a, it becomes a huge a bigger success yeah mm. man what legacy do you want to leave behind I don't know. Yeah. I don't know because eh, because five years ago mm. if you ask me where I would be singe kwambia hapa 10 mm. years ago ile time tulipatana ungeniuliza nataka kwa nini and I think tukirudi kwa hiyo interview liniuliza hiyo so nikakwambia siezi jua yeah. kile nitakuwa mm. but all I know is that I want to leave a positive impact mm. in whatever way I don't know what it is I don't know if it's ata hii kitu tofauti maybe it's something totally different, different but whatever it is it's to leave an impact a positive impact so that usikuwa ulikuja tu kama punda hata mm. punda inaachaga impact ya ilikuwa inabeba mizigo ile wakati ilikuwa mm. mm. hii nyumba ilijengwa na hiyo punda ilikuwa yes. inaleta mawe yeah. Yeah, so whatever it is become a positive impact yeah. mm. freely given freely learned cheers ah oh, cheers man it's a rap bwambia tu wangu bye <laughs> 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 Watu wangu kwa Irini Manze thank you so much. Yes. And thank you for support. Yaani umegonga mita. Sasa unalala aje ukijua uko na mita. Hebu tuongee sasa. Ati unalala hivi unapenduka uko na ajaye. Umeletea hiyo kitu kia gold. Imagine. <laughs> <Ayyaya. laughs> Tuna, Tunaifungua ka special event so. Ah la la must be nice. Tunaifungua it. It's, it's, it's hamu. Na bera kwa hapo. Guys bye. Thank you so much. Anna. Thank you so much for watching this show. <laughs> Can never be me. Mbudu mzima. <laughs> <laughs>
ana gold unajua mimi wa Daniel ni mdogo Abel Abel I am as innocent as they come oh you where do you make the platform no can be I say whatever I want ama tuonyeshe gold nini yake Abel anitakupatia yangu yetu uguze kidogo Yeah, yeah, kabla ikuje uh, tutakuwa tumezeeka guys, <laughs> <laughs> guys thank you for watching <laughs> let me know what your take home is from today's conversation we oh, are bell guy si yeah. utegwa mara mobo ategwe na watu wanunue kitabu njugushu.k <laughs> Tupate ya kumpeleka hospitali. Iko nuria. Yeah. Ai na nafaa kupeleka. Nuria do you know that's where I also pick my books. For real? Mm. I love those guys. Not, Not an ad but yeah. Nuria for me it's Kutoka Wahame, alafu after Wahamehama, yes. wakaenda hapo bazaar. Yes, mm. I love them because they mm. have supported Kenyan mm. authors. You go there? Actually I should have it there. You have it there at Nuria. 70% of their books mm. by the way, they are local. They have supported I know, Kenyan. na nimechukua mob sana. Eh. No boys na nanga na niongezea. <laughs> ni mpoa, ni mpoa. So, yeah. thank you for watching abel included i wish you well in your gold flake <laughs> and guys in your old age sounds more like in your old age remember to subscribe more on this channel no abel <laughs> and then you come kurum subscribe here but also i appreciate really i honestly hope we've picked a thing or to i always say you can never go wrong with god discipline consistency and i wish everyone of i'm vouching for anyone that is trying the, in this field i've said the cake is big enough for everyone and we won't be uh, gatekeepers shukran tap tap for coming through as our partners of today's conversation remember to send your money using them and get a cashback bonus if you use my promo code lin the details are on the screen and once again thank you for getting us to 1 million subscribers i appreciate you guys nyinyi ni wale watu and i hope by the end of this show tunaweza kuwa na hiyo kitabu wapi hapo nuria if not soon maybe next week some somehow it got to be there appreciate you guys for always coming through bye bye abel 1 million <laughs> have 1 million diesel <laughs>